classic colorway, decent quality. This Air Force One is up there with the staples right here. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. <laughs> Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Quick Scopes. Today we have the Air Force One, and this pair is in black, white. Let me take this opportunity to ask you to like, leave your thoughts, subscribe, ring that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Ah, uh, yeah, purchase links for these and the white and black pair in the description. Stay tuned for the on foot. So, yeah, let's start from the soles up. So we have a white outsole, we have a white midsole, midsole stitch, Nike Air and Strip, and then we come to this upper. So this upper is composed of black tumbled leather, and if we start from around the toe, you'll see that we have that black tumbled leather around the toe and on the toe box. The material quality is okay. I think it looks a lot better than the quality is, which it is what it is. Going up the shoe, you'll see this black tumbled leather on the eye stay. Today we have black laces. To the thickness that I like. These black laces conceal a black nylon tongue and at the top of this tongue you'll see that we have a black tongue tab with white for the Nike Air. Take a look at the mid portion of this shoe, again we have more of that black tumbled leather. And then we come to the swoosh. So the swoosh is a white tumbled leather but the grain is not as pronounced as on the upper of the shoe. It's still the same quality as the rest of the shoe however. The fox in returns to that black tumbled leather and then we've got that white leather return, same as the swoosh on the heel of the shoe with black for the Nike Air detail. Take a look inside the shoe, you'll see that we have a black sock liner with a black insole and white for the Nike Air. Let me know what you think of this pair. For me, an easy to wear black Air Force One. Classic colorway, decent quality. This Air Force One is up there with the staples right here. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. The contrast of the black and the white work well on this one. The white swoosh intersecting that black upper, really nice. And then you've got the midsole, which is also in white. A lot of contrast right here between the two, but I think it works. It would have been interesting to see a black midsole outsole combination. And I think, and I lean towards it being better than this colorway, but I think it's okay. This is pretty cool. The tumbled leather upper is okay. It's not the finest. As I've said, it looks a lot better than it actually feels in hand, the quality of the material. There are better tumbled levers out there, but it's an okay material. As I said, this one is decent. It's a decent pair, nothing to write home about, however. When it comes to the laces, black laces in this pair, perfect. You could swap them out maybe to a white lace. Of course, it would go with the swoosh and outsole combination. Maybe another color, depending on your outfit. Remember, only these black laces come with this pair, so if you want to do a lace swap, you can do from your lace box. This pair fits like normal Air Force Ones. Compared to other shoes, go down half a size. Let's check these out on feet. With all that being said, I give these a 7 out of 10. De decent, easy to wear, uh, good colorway which you can drop with almost anything. Let me know your thoughts on these and how do they compare to the white and black pair. 
similar to this white upper black swoosh but the midsole is white as well remember purchase links for both in the description check out that white and black air force one right here i've been scopes thank you everybody for subscribing sharing your thoughts it's always appreciated signing out see ya